Hi uh, guys, welcome back to Jazzgrass Gaming, where uh, absolutely nothing has happened. <laughs> <laughs> we just... You make it sound like I just like sneakily sucked your cock in between the episodes of it. Well, did you? <laughs> would you? I think you? I think you would have noticed, I don't know. Could you? <laughs> what, huh? Uh, Unless? <laughs> that's it. <laughs> oh man, the uh, tension is palpable. Nee, I was at the Utrecht Central today. Yeah. And we went to the fucking toilets. Mm. And a guy could, was standing next to me. And he just stood there. Yeah. He whipped his dick out. <laughs> he started pissing. And the moment he started pissing. Oh, fart. He ripped the hardest fart, mate. Oh. Oh, <laughs> just like while you're, right, while you're next to me. I couldn't piss here. anymore. <laughs> Like that intimidated me. Really? No. <laughs> I would have. Uh, I, I mean, I thought you were going to say I couldn't piss anymore because I was giggling. <laughs> That's what I would have done. Piss going everywhere. If someone's just loudly farting right next to me, just out of man, nowhere. I, I don't was, care if I know or not. That's funny. I was holding back, man. Like, I, I, feel like I, keep I, I feel straight. like at this point, if I'm going to have to smell your fart, then I, I earned the right to laugh. Oh, uh, <laughs> luckily, I didn't have to smell. Oh, <laughs> uh, good. Uh, me, but that was... That is fucking hilarious. Just like, fucking hell, man. That is so... That is fucking funny. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> so... Like, that poor bastard might have been... <laughs> it's probably like, oh, fuck shit. <laughs> of course I'm farting at the end, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> like, I'd be a little... Like, oh... oh. <laughs> Sorry, boys. Uh, if I go to take a piss, and I know I have to take... Uh, have to fart pretty bad, I, just, I take a stall. Yeah, of course. That's what I do, and then I just let her rip. <laughs> yeah. Oh, mate. Uh, this man took a chance. <laughs> I remember back when I was a kid, when we went to the Utrecht Center Station, I was like, Mom, I gotta pee. Uh, I gotta pee. And uh, she was like, well, you gotta have to wait till we get onto the train, because I'm not letting you use the restroom here at the Center Station. Yeah. And she, uh, but she worked at the Center Station at that time. So, uh, you know, she, uh, she uh, you know, I was like, why, why can't I go down there? And she's well because there's heroin addicts down there. Yep, that used to be a huge fucking problem there. Yeah, she used to walk by, like multiple heroin addicts, and, uh, you know, uh, and then homeless folk uh, along the way to uh, to her work. And uh, these days, there's not much of a you heroin problem. You don't see anymore. it anymore that much. I wonder we, why. We mostly have. Uh, well, I don't. I think like heroin they, is they, just they, gone out of fashion. That as well. It is Honestly, like out of all the drugs you could choose. Like, come on. Like, man. we've got a lot better ones. I mean, our wheat's gotten stronger. You know, we got meth with speed. We got MDMA, ecstasy. Got it all. Like, especially here in the Netherlands, you got coke. I feel like most heroin addicts probably like transfer uh, transfer over to meth or methadone. Whew. I don't know, but I mean, there was a bit of a crackdown on it. I think as well. Yeah. Like, I feel yeah, like in a couple um, of years, they really cleaned up the city. Ah, but it's, it's, uh, yeah. Talking about drugs, I went to buy some weed yesterday, right? Yeah. And I went to the coffee shop, and I got there. I was like, hey, man, how's it going? Uh, I would like five grams of haze. Um, you know, can I, uh, can I pin? And they were like, uh, I, well, yeah, but do you mind, like, using the ATM behind the pillar over there? Uh, <laughs> and I was like, ah, sure. Not shady at all. I was like, ah, sure, why not, right? Yeah. So I, uh, yeah. so I just did, uh, you know, I just, my, and they were like, ah, oh, thanks, man. Um, yeah. So I was like, all right, and I want, I went to hand it over. He's like, no, no, you don't give it to me. You just feed it into the machine. Does it, it does all the work for it. Oh, before. nice. They got that safe base system going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. They did the slurpy machine. We got well, that as they, well. Well, they take COVID very serious there. Right. Oh shit. That the mention of that. Oh yeah. Look, I'm just saying, I'm glad that they're taking it serious. Exactly. But, uh, yeah, no, uh, so I paid, and, uh, but, and, uh, like, this fancy-ass machine just grabbed my money, and it just sort of counted the bills, and it was like, damn, this machine is more more gangster than a fucking drug car cartel <laughs> guy counting his fucking dope, jeez. And it's and never then, wrong, oh. And then with all the oh. swagger oh. in the oh, world of nice. taking my money, it then completely breaks my illusion of this, of this inanimate object having some sort of badass personality <laughs> by a very very fucking sneakily having the bill come out at the bottom but like i didn't you know you gotta like really work and put your hand in there to get it out 
Oh, wow. You got to fondle his gooch to get yeah, the fucking yeah, yeah, bill yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> He did not want to pay me. He was, he was gladly counting my money. But when it came time to give me my money, all of a sudden I could go fuck myself. Yeah, he was grabbing out of that. No, all no, of a no, sudden no, no, he's no. like, hey, man, you got to cut my balls first. You got you to gotta work for that you gotta, money. You got to you gotta rub my gooch. <laughs> <laughs> Hey man, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I had an ex that did that when she was sucking me off and it feels good. Yeah? Yeah? Give that Gucci little Roby. Give, give it a, give it a little, give it a little poke. I don't know. Uh, alright, now. Let's try not to let's, flip it again. <laughs> now, last episode, did you seriously just wear the helmet the entire way back <laughs> in the tractor? Just why not? Because because then it's not floating around in my fucking cabin. Yeah, true. <laughs> and I'm extra safe. It's fucking racing day, Brian. <laughs> it is racing day. I'll admit that. I'll admit that. It. I mean, <laughs> gotta be safe, mate. You gotta be safe it's in the streets. Just, I feel like a lot of people because well, online right. I always read that people get very frustrated yeah. with the helm because it blocks too much vision. So I'm just I'm just worried about people's viewing experience. You know. All right, all they right. want to see all the glorious Let me... pixels and polygons uh, uh, of this. Ah, uh, my eyes. Too much light Early coming 2000s in. Early 2000s looking game. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking golden eye on the N64. Bro, people, <laughs> imagine going back to the past. People are like, oh, what are video games like in the future, bro? Because they, you know, Mario's yeah. just come out. And we're just, <laughs> you just rock up. And you show them this. <laughs> it's so, like, God, it's the most accurate life simulator there is. <laughs> this is literally... <laughs> we play games that simulate our lives in rural Finland. We like to uh, have jobs next to our jobs to relax. <laughs> doing, uh, doing grueling work every day just to try and fix up a car <laughs> so that we may die in a race. We're trying to live the finish And then try it all the... over again. <laughs> uh, mate. I can't wait. I mean, that is if you have permanent iPhone, which we don't. Oh, luckily not. Like I've, I've, I've ruined a couple of days. Fuck you. In my own fucking room. Cheer for me, you <laughs> bastard. Woo! Nah, now they're not cheering because they're like, oh, he's not a razor. He doesn't even have a helmet on. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> da, shut I'm up, like, man. I'm that like one of those bullshit. autistic kids who needs to walk around. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Don't man. bump your head too much, mate. You already ain't got a lot in there. Listen, Chrome Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you calling me Chrome Boy all of a sudden, man? Oh. Jesus. Uh, watch out, man. I'm gonna keep my helmet on while I'm fighting you. It's so, a secret uh, weapon. I was playing Sea of Thieves, and I had this PvP yeah, yeah. player after me, and he ignored a brigantine to get, uh, to, get to me. Now the brigantine was just docked, right? It was and not even at an outpost, just at an island, right? Yeah. So the guy probably had loot, you know, and 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 the people of that boat weren't even on the boat; they were on the island, <sighs> and and I boat right past it, like super clean past mm -hmm. it, right? So you know, and, and the PVP guy is like, "Nah, fuck that! I'm going for the sloop." Yeah, exactly. Like, like fu <laughs> fuck having a battle with a brigantine. I'm gonna go for this sloop. And I'm like, fuck <laughs> Like, off, how much dude. of a pussy are you? And I, like, <laughs> there were three people on a sloop, which isn't technically possible at all. Yeah, they just... Yeah. So I want so I want to know what the fuck happened there to begin with. Maybe it was like, like when we uh, had that same thingy. Like, we had a guy join us. Like, Fair from enough. The <laughs> But, 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 but just leave. I, I, I had no loot. I <laughs> so had no stupid. loot on me. Like at that point, you're just doing it to be a I fucking dick. I was just dick. trying to do the uh, seasonal PVE adventure, uh, the one where you chase ghosts and stuff, and I was doing pretty well. I was on like the last two pages, and then just this fucking dude. <laughs> On my way there, right? The moment I reach the island, I look behind me and this fucker is behind me. So I try to boat away and he's following me. And of course, I, I, it doesn't matter where I go in Sea of Thieves, by the way. I, it There's matter. always somebody. If I could be boating in a circle and I'm always against the wind. I, I hate that. Always. Like, I've noticed that when I'm playing with you. Always. And on my own, it's like... Like, I go south 
Right, I go from, like, my, my four eight tells me, alright, go from all the way from the north of the map to the south of the map. I'm like, okay, fine. But I'm against the wind because the wind is currently blowing towards north, right? But then, I'm at the south and I have to go back north for the rest of the voyage, right? And then, I, uh, from, and then the wind has turned around! <laughs> it's the worst, like, it's... It's I the old phenomenon of, so unlucky. of riding your bike to school like in the morning against oh, the wind, dude. and then when you go back home, it's against that's, the wind. That's enough to ruin my day. Yep, it's uh. I I I guess I, I remember that. having that back in the day, and if that happened, don't talk to me when <laughs> I get home. Just <laughs> leave, leave me, me for a please. bit because I am fuming. Because <laughs> for the fucking biking, mate. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I've ever biked with the wind in my back. I just re no once when I was a kid. There was uh, there was an autumn when it was really stormy, mm. and uh, I just I just it was storming so fucking hard that I just sort of opened my jacket and like, I, I fucking kite like sailed my it. way home. Yep. Of course, you know using your jacket as a sail doesn't actually help. But it's not that feel, much, <laughs> but, but it feels, but feels like, nice. But I was still going forward, and um, you know what? Yeah, I had a lot of fun, because I just sailed my way home. That's like the most fucking Dutch thing ever, if you were also on an icy, especially on the, an icy lake. Especially the part where I don't have both my hands on the steering exactly. wheel. Exactly, <laughs> because you're on a bike sailing, and then you'd be on the fucking frozen lake, so you'd also be fucking ice skating. Oh yeah. Well, not fucking having your hands on the steering wheel. Ah, uh, I remember riding my bike on the ice, and we we used to like we had a drift and all that stuff. Yeah. And we do a little race to see who could who could you know get to the other side of the creek fastest or without or the dying. <laughs> How do you call that? The fucking the slope. Uh, moat. No. Moat. No. I know there's a word yeah, for there's it. There's definitely I, a word I, for I, it. I keep forgetting the word. It's though. not a creek. It's a standing still creek. I guess. <sighs> A polder. A polder? That's, uh, that, 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 I mean, How do you call I it? get where you're an, going an, with that, but it's an not. irrigation path. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. You know, it's technically correct. Hey, you didn't flip it this time. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Brian, wait. We're, not, we're not there yet. Yeah, calm down. All dude. right, just keep your distance. Keep yeah, your distance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I mean, maybe I can pick a fruit. Oh. Wow. All right. So all that for nothing, huh? <laughs> all right. Look, Ryan. Look, I look, learned from my mistake. I can forgive you. All right. It's just if the audience can. Oh, Brian, I, you're you know you. Why? Why? It almost looked like it was gonna flip again. Why are you doing this to me, game? <laughs> like it is not having its day with me. Oh yeah, no, this is not your lucky day. All right. So oh, we put the other now, so I don't have to fucking carry it. So, uh, what, what's the mission for today? Uh, it's Saturday. There's not a lot we could do today. Wanna work on the car? <sighs> Fucking Flitari ain't in on a Saturday. Like, I'm gonna... <sighs> they I really know. need to add a fishing rod. <sighs> they definitely need... All we oh, got yeah. is the fishing. I've been doing some fishing. In the Sea of Thieves. And, um... Wow. I never knew <laughs> that that... that, that a game could add something so tedious <laughs> to a g so that that seems like so that <laughs> most other games that have fishing have got it figured out because it's a but pretty sea easy of concept is a now different. is it <laughs> sea of thieves is a little different you got to fight the fish <laughs> but if you <laughs> but sometimes that doesn't even like so, okay so you you go you put your bait on your hook you throw your hook into the water you get her some shitty fucking basic ass fish, right? Uh, that, that nibbles on your bait and he starts fighting, you know. And you gotta like pull in the opposite direction that the fish is going. But the <laughs> fish is changing directions every two microseconds. And, um, you oh, know. It's fucking spoiled. And then it tires out. Oh, it's fucking spoiled. How is it already spoiled? It's been less than a week. Oh, you can't tell me that. No, that's good. Is that one another color? It, Looks like it. It is. Okay, it is. Oh, and it is, of course, the kitchen. Oh, uh, for fuck sake. Uh, I was like, how can it be spoiled after only, like, what, a day? But no, that makes sense. Alright, so you gotta... Yes. And yeah, then you yeah, can, yeah. like... Put a fucking fuse in yeah, that bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if these are good. Oh, let me check. Okay, I can see it. Okay, that's bad. Fucking waste it. 
chuck it on the ground. I don't care. Pollution, not my problem. It's fucking 1995. We didn't think about that back then. Alright, thank you. What? I mean, scientists have known since the 1800s how bad uh, yeah. pollution is. We just haven't been caring for yeah. as long. Fair enough, fair enough. So what, you're gonna tell me it works now? Yep. God damn it. God fucking damn it. Great, great what, game, what great a, game. What a great day great to game. rule my... my uh, good thing I got potato chips. Um, how did it... Br oh, it must have been the storm. And we didn't notice because we're dumb as bricks. We forgot to check the fucking fuses no, properly. No, but after... No, I checked afterwards. And I even did some things in the kitchen. Wait, so it just randomly broke? I guess it just gave out. Sorry, time. Dennis? Dennis? Th this is ridiculous. That's not how fuses work. Dennis? I know, I know. Because you gotta sh fucking put a lot of amps through it. That is what it does. It protects you from a surge. So the only reason it could have happened is a storm. That's yeah. is what I'm saying. If there, if it didn't have because of the storm, then the developer is d uh, just fucked up. <laughs> he's a real dick. -em. No, no, yeah. uh, it's not. He's not just a dick. He's wrong. Incorrecto. He doesn't know how fucking mundo. fuses work. He is not correct. That like fuses don't just blow out. They don't they just don't. blow out. Something needs to happen before that. Like, what, what, did you have the television, the washing machine, the microwave, and your electric uh, stove on at the same time or something? What are you doing? And also, what they do you, don't... What, how is it? What, what do you, they don't even break. Like, most of the time, they just pop out, and you can pop them back in again. Exactly. They, they, I don't know if it was like that back in 1995, but you'd think... I had think. a fuse board from the 1980s. Yeah, like, so... And it was more <sighs> sturdy than this. This is so stupid. Finnish, like, maybe Finland was just way behind the times. Like, what a what bunch of that, fucking nerds. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Don't move I'm to so Finland, confused. I guess. <laughs> Does the developer never... I, 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 I'm not convinced the developer has ever had a house with these kinds of fuses, man. I think he just still lives with he his parents and he doesn't know. I think he's nah. I think he's got those switch fuses, you know, the new ones. Ah, yeah, yeah. yeah I, good, I, I generally like okay. the fuses don't pop out of nowhere. No. If they do, well, your your government has a lot of questions to answer. <laughs> as as to your energy infrastructure, <laughs> because if you, you know, that, that, it's that, like that, we got to check some cables on yeah, where they're leading I mean, to. That like, there's something wrong with this, you know. Stealing energy from your neighbors and shit, like that is. Such a hilarious concept to me. Oh, Although yeah. it is fucking dangerous as fuck. All right, I'm just I mean, gonna... here in the Netherlands, we steal uh, uh, energy from electricity uh, yeah, right. or from lantern... From lantern poles? Lantern posts, yes. yes. With, uh, to power our weed growers. Yep. You gotta get it somewhere, you know. If it's not legal, then, then we'll improvise. Same with tobacco. Yep. It's gonna happen. I'm yep. telling you, it's, 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 of it's course. gonna happen, bro. Of course. They've learned nothing from the past. It's gonna be so convenient, though. Now I don't have to go to the store for tobacco. I can buy my... Pl I, could, I could just hit on my plug. Yeah. It's like, uh, I could just get it off the black market, and uh, it, it'll be more convenient because, you know, I can still just... And no tax. Exactly. No the government is weird. It is strange. Every time we think we're... We, we, every time... We, uh, you know, we begin to be like, okay, so maybe prohibition doesn't work. The government just steps in and goes, except for when it's this particular thing yeah. <laughs> that I don't like. I'm wondering if I should take the... Yeah, I'm gonna take you with me. Okay, I got a plan. I got a plan. We're just gonna... We're just gonna chill out, Brian. We're gonna have a little vacation on the lake, because... Take the radio. Oh, hell yeah, man. I'm going back. Got a couple of things I want to grab. Oh, nice. Of course, of course. You can't have a... Nice, you know, retreat on your lake mansion <laughs> without bringing some alcohol. How the hell have we been going for 20 minutes? Damn, we're flowing, guys. Next time on Jazzgrass Gaming, we'll be on vacation. Yeah, See next time, ya. paid vacation day. Bye. <laughs>